Hi everyone, this is your math guru. In this video, I'm going to show you how to translate points on the Cartesian plane. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button below for more easy to understand math concept. Translation is a geometric transformation that moves a point left, right, up or down. For example, if I have the point Z with coordinates X, Y, translated to X plus H, Y plus V, what it means is your edge is the horizontal shift while that's your edge while your V is your vertical shift so for example if I have the Cartesian plane with my X and Y axis I have my X axis that's the horizontal and my Y axis that's the vertical then if the value of H or the horizontal shift is greater than zero that is it's positive what that means is my point is going to move to the right if the value of H is less than zero as shown then that means my point is going to move to the left. That's H is less than zero. However, if the value of my V, that's the vesicle shift, is greater than zero, vesicle shift is a Y axis, then my point is going to move up. And if the value of V is less than zero, vertical shift downward, then my point is going to move then what let's look at the following example for illustration i have vertical shift greater than zero vertical shift less than zero in this example i have translate the following points point a with coordinate three six and b with coordinates minus two five using the translation x y going to x plus one that's the horizontal shift to the right and y minus 4 that's the vertical shift downwards the first step is to look at my point on the cartesian plane i have point 36 that's three units to the right and six units upwards on the y-axis i have point a with coordinates 3 6 and likewise for coordinates b i have two units to the left and five units upwards so i have that as point B that's minus 2 5 showing you how to calculate the translation if A is going from 3 6 to translate A I have X plus 1 Y minus 4 so what I'm going to do is for my X coordinates I'm going to add 1 And for my y coordinates, I'm going to minus 4. So my new point will be x plus 1, that's 3 plus 1. I have 4 for my x axis. And for my y axis, I have 6 minus 4, that's 2. So going back to the Cartesian plane, my new point will be 4, 2. That will be positive 4 for my x and positive 2. That's A prime will be 4, 2. That's if I'm working it out. If I'm to use the Cartesian plane directly, what I'm going to do is I have starting from point B, which is minus 2, 5. I'm to move one unit to the right. So I have one unit to the right. And minus 4, Y minus 4. That's four units downwards. That's 1, 2, 3, and 4. So my new point for B will be B prime with coordinates negative 1, 1. Also, if I need to calculate that, I can also do that easily by saying points B, which is minus 2, 5, going to the new point will be, I'm adding or moving one unit to the right for my x-axis 
and I'm moving four units downward for my y-axis. So I have that as minus one plus one, that's minus one, and five minus four, that's positive one. Thanks for watching. Bye.